Hey guys, welcome back to Daily Samuel. This is episode 96. Beautiful, beautiful Wednesday morning. Wednesday, yeah, technically, right? It's, it's Wednesday it, fucking it morning. This is literally dude. Wednesday morning because we're, re- we're recording this episode at 1 in the morning. Guess what, bro? 1 in the morning. It's I mean, fucking insomnia time, dude. Insomnia time, dude. It's insomnia time, dude. It's insomnia time. This is the moment where all those deepest, darkest secrets come out. Fucking demons, bro. The demons... Come drag you out. Las brujas, you know what I'm saying? The witches come out. Oh, switching bro, out right? everything, dude. You know what I mean? Everything. If, if this was um paranormal activity, some cabinets would be opening right now. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? The footsteps, like, you know. It's the, it's if, the witch hour. If, if, if I had some, like, powdered sugar and put it on the floor, you would see some footsteps. <laughs> yeah. It's that kind of time. You know what I'm saying? Dude, um, I just noticed you're wearing sandals. I, I, yes, I am, dude. I look I, at you. I'm wearing sandals. I'm I look at you. shit right now, dude. I'm, I'm like, this dude, you're... Almost too comfortable, dude. I'm super comfy right now, dude. dude I comfy. had to. I had a long ass day at work. Plus, I recorded water report. I had to come. What? I had to come comfy. comfy. You, you recorded what? Wa- water report. Never heard of it. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it's actually um, a big hit on YouTube right now, dude. Is it? <laughs> it has as, as many followers as uh, Dan Scott. No, that we have more. <laughs> By two. Oh really? <laughs> I don't know. Oh no 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 I'm no because no, I'm, I'm like I'm pretty sure you guys are like at, at ten. <laughs> <laughs> like. <it's, laughs> Oh, um, so people dude, love, dude, people love it. <coughs> you right, bro? You right, dude? They go down the wrong fucking hole every day, man. <laughs> every day, dude. No, um, dude, I gotta say, so we we we've been drinking a lot of more gin recently. I'm not mad at it, dude. I'm not I'm mad, mad at, at it either. Dude. I'm not mad at it. You know, we're mojito. We're you know, mojito's always been the daily salmon drink, right? I was trademarked yes, by daily salmon. Yeah, 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 yes. Mojitos is where it's at, and we've done Cuba, um, Cuba Libres, which is which rum is and a coke, nice, which is a nice drink as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And for the most part, that's that's pretty much that's all we've done. That's yeah, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. We kind of stayed with rum for the most part. Mm-hmm. Now we've jumped over to gin, I'm not mad. and we're not mad at it for multiple reasons. One, the mojitos uses carbonation, right? Yeah, it uses either um, um, I use squirt, but it's made with tonic, mm-hmm. right? Which is carbonated water. Mm-hmm. And um, this new drink I've been, we've been drinking on the podcast. You can see on our story, on our Instagram story. Dude, <laughs> <You're> right, <bro? laughs> dude it's, <laughs> it's, it's in the back of my throat right now. Dude, right now, all of, I've been trying to hold back a cough. And I'm dying, dude. <laughs> Your eyes are <laughs> red, bro. Dude, I, <laughs> dude, I, Your face is blood right now, dude. <laughs> dude I, I, I just died right You're now. You're the reddest I've ever seen you, bro. All right, dude. You got to finish the story, dude. Yeah, hey. 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 Can, you, can you finish some of the people's I story? I do. Hey. Because I got to find Right it. now, the drink we're drinking right now is on Instagram. As, you, as, as you'll be able to tell <laughs> when this video is out. But, um, dude, this gin dude, what, what do you call him? It's called Eastside. Eastside, bro. Eastside. It goes by different names. It was basically a gin, a gin drink with cucumber, mint, and lime, and um, sugar. Fucking delicious, dude. Yeah. Delicious. Liquid sugar, basically. And it has so uh, the reason we like to drink more, not more, but the reason we enjoy this drink it's now, it's more refreshing, less sweet, more refreshing, and no carbonation. For me, that's the number one thing. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Because no I mean, when I drink, you know, I don't fucking drink little, beer. Yeah, I don't yeah, drink yeah, beer. Yeah. I, I fuck beer, dude, all day. Well, you get a little bloated because it's so. But yeah, but when you drink anything carbonated, anything that involves mm-hmm. a type of carbonation, I get bloated, man. For sure, it yeah, happens I mean, all of us, the best of us. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah. Six pack going 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 home, bro. You know what I mean? Yeah, you're right. <laughs> Body going out of party. Six pack staying in. Six pack has a work day in the morning. You know what I mean? I wake up early. You know what I mean? So I've been enjoying the drink for that reason. That I just don't feel that bloatiness, and I feel it's like uh, it hits harder, bro. I don't. It doesn't hit me harder actually. What it does, it um. I hate I hate how you fucking tell me that this shit hits me harder than it hits you. But you know it does though. I don't know why. It just no. I don't know it's fucking genetics, why. bro. Genetics. Yeah, I, I don't know about genetics, bro. Gen- no, it is I'm genetics. Stars or not, bro? You're seeing stars, dude. You <laughs> you about to pass out midway this podcast, dude. You know what I mean, I mean, dude. I'm about to sleep okay, right now, dude. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Here, here's the clearest. Here's the clearest. Bore me for no, ten no. minutes. I'm going to sleep. Here's the clearest um thing about me, right? Okay. When Ramon gets buzzed, what happens? What's the he, first thing that happens? What's the first thing that happens? He think about this. Think about this. Mm. When I get buzzed, what's the first thing I do? Mm, mm. You um, you're uh, you start being funnier. No, 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 no. <laughs> that's 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 twenty for seven. That's twenty for seven. What's the first thing I do? 
You break the seal. I break the seal. Have ever broken the seal? You have not yet. No. I technically have. You've broken the seal. I have. Yes. Well, my last meal was at fucking three o'clock. So yeah. My last meal was at uh, four o'clock. Okay. Okay. Yeah. And I worked out prior. Afterwards. 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 I worked. Yeah. Not the same. (laughs) 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 Not the same. Right. (laughs) You know what I mean? You burn. You burn as much cardio working as I do. Sleeping, sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> but no, no. I mean, yeah, dude. It's just one of those dreams that it doesn't hit me hard, man. And I mean, to be fair, I, I've grown. T- I've. You're not calling, bro. You give me high time. I'm not calling. <laughs> you go to AA every. I'm not. I'm not, I'm not going to say I haven't gone to work <laughs> after a drink or two. <laughs> not saying I have. Not saying I have neither. You know what I mean? <laughs> Keeping it fair. Um, but no, no. I, I join a drink for that reason. Yeah, it's just sure. it's a smooth drink, and it, it goes on well. Smooth. And we're I actually... Um, I love cucumber, dude. Yeah, no, cucumber Cucumber's is delicious, good. dude. Especially Mexican cucumber. Oh, it's like dude. With Bino, oh, dude. You know, with fucking salt, lime, chili, dude. It's like the best thing ever, dude. But um, we're going to be... Um, within the first... Within the next couple of weeks, we're going to actually um, upload a video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where we teach you guys how to make the drinks that we drink on the episode. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You know, when it comes to the mojito, when it comes to the the east side, Cuba Libres. And we're actually going to be changing the drink... Every month. So every month, we're going to be drinking a new drink on the episode. We're going to go from whiskey to tequila to rum. Um, of course. Fuck vodka. Yeah. Fuck vodka. Cause... You know what, dude? I. You know what? Have you, tra- have you ever tried Tito's? No, no, no. no. Look, tried Tito's? Look, look, I try. I, tr- you I know, I know you can mask it. I just don't want to drink you it. Don't mask? Okay. I don't want to drink okay. it. I've, I I okay. gave up um, vodka a long time ago. Okay. Fair and I, enough. Just, I don't want to go back to it. It reminds me of college. Exactly. It reminds me, of, reminds me of a, of a dumber version of me. You know what I'm trying to say? <laughs> so, not again. Not again. Oh, um, and yeah, we're just gonna we're gonna drink drinks on episode, obviously, mm-hmm. and we're gonna put up the videos mm-hmm. on our channel, and we're yeah. gonna teach you guys how to make them, so you guys can grab a drink and drink it with us yeah. while you listen to the episode, and you can actually see how much more funnier we are when you're <laughs> as buzz as we are. Oh yeah, dude. Yeah, you're because, you're you're at our level. Yeah. It's it's a good time. It's funnier. It's good funnier. Time. It's funnier. Time. You know what I mean? It's good you're time, like dude. you're like oh now I actually understand them. <laughs> you know, not like YouTube when you put a, you put subtitles on our video. I'm like wah, 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 wah. <laughs> it makes no sense, dude. <laughs> it makes no sense. Dude, I have not seen our dude, subtitles in a dude, while. Our podcast is decently funny, right? It's decently, it's yeah, decently yeah, funny. You put subtitles thing. on that motherfucker. Oh, dude, it is hilarious, dude. <laughs> it is fucking hilarious, dude. <laughs> It's basically we're, we're talking Latin, and and the, and YouTube is trying to figure that shit. Out. I was like, I don't, <laughs> dude, uh, I don't know, dude. I think Combination it's, Spanish, <laughs> Italian, some right. French. I think he said banana. Just add banana. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Fuck it, dude. But um, yeah, dude. So look out for that. Um, we'll, we should have that up in a couple weeks. Yeah, yeah, for sure. For sure. Um, for sure. Dude, um, let's get down to it, dude. Right. Let's get, tell I'm, me, dude. I'm sorry, tell dude. me. I'm sorry, dude. I got Don't at me, dude. I gotta bring it. Don't at me, bro. I gotta bring it up, dude. Hey, dude. Ask first. Let's go. Okay. Ask first. <laughs> yeah. Is that what you say? Yeah. Is, is that what you say to the women? You're like, yeah, ask first. I'm gonna ask first, and then we'll see what happens. <laughs> yeah. I'm not, um, trying, I'm not trying to talk to your face. Yeah, trying, yeah. Talk to that ass. You know, I know the movement. What's up? Um, <laughs> you get you got a little sad on me this weekend, dude. Bro, 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 bro. We bro, got a little, bro, bro, bro. no. We gotta I, we gotta talk about. It. We gotta talk about. Uh, it. I want to say I want to say sad. So sad, dude. I was in the, hey, bro, okay, I, I was I drunk. Was, to be fair, I was drunk. I was talking to you off the cliff. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> You were there, dude. I I can hear the ocean was, in the background, dude. I was the, I was the second story. I was the second story um, bar, dude. So was, you, were, you were like, I was ready. it's high enough? Is that what you were asking in the back of the head? Yeah, like, is it high enough? Do I do I become paraplegic or do, <laughs> do, I, uh, do I finish it here? Do I go ahead first? Or what's going on? It's just one of those things that, man, dude, you're at the fucking club. Or, no, you're at the bar, man. And... You're a group. You're okay, with your so, friends. Yeah. You're with your friends. Yeah. And you holler at another group of women. A group of women with your friends. Yeah. And it doesn't ever go your fucking way. Yeah. Maybe, maybe, maybe me, but it, it definitely didn't go with the, the people I was with. Yeah. Did not go their way either. Yeah. Except one lucky fellow. Yeah. One lucky fellow managed to be interesting. Be interesting. Yeah. He, he got, a, he got a, a bite on the line. Uh, he did. He got a yeah. bite. He got a bite. He got a bite, dude. Yeah. So you, so this happens, right? I'm at work. You, you text me. <laughs> hey, 
<laughs> yeah, of course. You text I was like, me. It's like what one one thirty in the morning. It's one thirty, something around yeah, that. Yeah, 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 I'm at work. You text me and you're like, I don't know why I text like, you, dude. Bro. I don't know why the fuck I text you. Always you always do, dude. Yeah, I do. I, yeah, you because you, you're my best friend. Yeah, bro. and and, and best friend. And I because I give you sound advice, man. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> I give you sound advice, and you're like, bro, I can't anymore, bro. <laughs> fuck this shit. <laughs> yeah. You you were like, I uh, really said that. Yeah, verbatim. you were like, you're like, bro, I can't do this anymore, bro. It's like I'm done. I'm done. And I was like, and so I was like, what's going on, man? He's like, yeah, bro, you know, I'm done with women, dude. I'm going for guys now, dude. Yeah. And I was like, and like, hey, bro, you Completely know. Completely never said that. <laughs> dude, I don't judge, bro. You Fake know what I mean? News, bro. I'm, a, I'm, a, news. I'm part of the team. I'm part of the team. You know what I'm saying, dude? <laughs> yeah, I'm like, hey, man. I understand you. I understand, understand you. you. I understand you. <laughs> no, but you were like, yeah, you were like basically like, girl, like these girls, they don't want any. And I'm like, <laughs> they don't want any. <laughs> and I was like, I was like, I get it. I, I don't get it. You know, like, you know, I was saying with them. Yeah. I was like, I, I get it. <laughs> You're like, they don't want any of this, bro. <laughs> I get it. <laughs> You're like, they, like, they look at me and they walk away. And I'm like, bro, <laughs> I see it. Damn, bro, don't put me down like that, dude. dude. Don't put me down like that. Dude, hey, I, hey, hey. Dude, I'm, I'm repeating by, I'm quoting you, hey, dude. Yeah, I give a shot. I, I, I give a shot. I, sh- I, sh- I, sh- I, I get sh- a motherfucking shot. I should put quotation marks in what I'm saying right now and then put Gamal <laughs> Gam- Gam- D. I just cite you MLA style, dude. <laughs> <Yeah, laughs> MLA style. <laughs> put your last name, put the year, dude, right there. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> 2000. Yeah, dude, 19. Dude, dude. <laughs> <laughs> and you were, that was basically I was telling you. But here, here's the thing, right? So you didn't have any luck, right? No, of course. You didn't have any luck that I, night. I know, knowing, knowing. Yeah. No, knowing. Yeah. Dude, but, if I'm sober, I want to give a shit. Yeah. I'm drunk. I'm yeah, you're drunk, right? You know, and and if you go to our Instagram stories, you can see the most scariest <laughs> snarl I've ever seen in my whole fucking life. It's on the uh, yeah. daily memes. Daily memes on our Instagram page, but um, <laughs> the highlight. <laughs> if you so you you text me this and I'm like, well, bro, I mean, it's, of course I'm, I'm at a fucking bar, dude. You had a sports bar, a sports, sports bar, bar dude. You know what I'm saying? Two story sports bar. Yeah, Deuce is in fucking Chicago. Yeah, you're at Wrigley, which is a lot of. College kids, yeah, a bunch younger of younger generation, fuck girls, fuck boys. It's just you yeah. know, a cocktail fucking problems. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. It's just not a scene for you, man. Nah, dude. It's not a scene for mo- it's not a scene for multiple people. You're right. You know what I'm trying to say? It's one of those things where it's just like when you walk in that bar, you're already at a at a disadvantage. You know what, dude? Dude, I I got a sense for the people that they fucking do some damage. Goofy and fucking white. Yeah. I don't know why, but it's a sports bar, it's sports goofy white sports bar, you're goofy white. Yeah, you're right, bro. You can yeah. you might get laid. Yeah, you might you might couple couple numbers. Well, it's it's built for their environment, right? But at the end of the day, <laughs> end of the day, is, 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 just keep it real. I mean, you're not a kid anymore, dude. No, dude, no, you're no, not a kid, no, right? No. I'm looking you're, for a wife. Bro. You're closer to dirty than you are to twenty. Hey, hey, I'm not saying the number. I'm not saying the number. I'm saying you're you're dirty, closer, dirty. You close look for a wife, bro. You close to dirty, dude. Look, look for a wife, and. If you want to actually meet somebody, dude, you gotta go more your range. A sports bar is not gonna work out. No, dude. no, no, no. Never does. You know, I've been there. You would have a better chance at a regular bar. This is a regular bar. It could be you have a better chance mm-hmm. at a lounge. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Where you know people, people, people are already established in life. You know what I mean? People are established. Like you know, dude. You know, you know what? You know, you know what's my fucking? Uh, oh man, tell me my my audience, dude. What? Fucking moms picking up the kids' daycare. Okay, that's my type. No, you know, you know, what your audience, you know, you know, no, 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 this, <laughs> no, no, this is your audience. This is your, this is your, audience. your, your audience. You no, know, here's like, here's your audience. Your audience is not the forgettable. Oh you know shit, saying, dude. Nah, you, you dude, go and nah, nah, you, you go into nah. um the the nah, the dude, island of know. of a forgotten toys that Chris movie. <laughs> we are the island of forgotten <laughs> toys. What movie is that? It's like it's a Chris movie, dude. Um, Rudolph goes and it's like he he's fighting um he's fighting um, Rudolph the Red Nose Ranger. Yeah, dude, it's what? um it's what no, he, you know. And it's like the fire the fire guy in the in the ice. Okay, ice, okay, yeah, you yeah, know yeah, what I'm talking yeah, about? Yeah, yeah, nah, dude, nah, and dude, you dude. go to Island of Forgotten Toys. We are the Island I don't know the of Forgotten story, <laughs> Toys, and that's you, dude. That's you. Wow, but the Forgotten Women. And <laughs> uh no, I'm, I'm saying no, dude. You forgotten? No, no, don't put me in that fucking category, dude. Hey, 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 let me get the moms at least, dude. Let me get the fucking moms at least, dude. You know what? I'm just gonna, I'm gonna stick out of fucking I do. Daycare. Look, you look, moms. Look, looking for moms. Yeah. You know what mom's doing? You single? You know what mom's doing? <laughs> they stay away from me, bro. <laughs> you know what <laughs> They got better to do. They're like, oh, you wanna go to the sports bar? Yeah. Um, 
thought we were gonna go out for dinner, maybe get a nice meal. <laughs> Maybe get a drink or two. Uh, it's, it's, like I said, it's fucking sports bar, bro. It's, it's whatever. It's yeah. whatever. Yeah. It's whatever. See, dude, my, I was my mood. That was my feelings. I wouldn't even waste my time. I wouldn't I'm even waste friends. my time. I'm a friend. We're, we're looking for a good time. Yeah, but just better. But here's the thing, though. I get it. I get it. Looking for a good time. You know, if you were younger, if that was still your scene. Yeah, yeah but I mean, you guys are grown ass fucking adults. Damn, bro. Don't put me I'm only I'm only 27, bro. No, no, I'm not. Look, no, I'm not saying Yo, that. What's my scene right now, bro? Hey, you're I'm seeing, I'm my telling scene? you, you're seeing. You would be better off going at a more chill bar. Where we're not, they're not playing the Cubs game. So we're not looking at Wrigleyville. So we're looking no, at, no, yeah, Wrigley, River North. Wrigley, Wrigleyville River should be out of the question, dude. River North. Wrigley, maybe, so what, yeah, am I looking River for North. A wife? I'm looking for a good time. No, 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 no. no but here's the thing: you used to find have a good time in all those places. You could, but yeah. I'm going to say you're going to find women more established, women more. Um, Looking more, for the same thing you're looking for. More, more to the point. Yeah, more, in, more in the same stage of life that is you are. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> which is nowhere. Which is bank, which is worse which, I am. Which is bankrupt. Uh, <laughs> 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 are you bankrupt too? Uh, um, so, what is what is your interest right now? Um, let's talk. You got a kid? Yeah. Hey, I got. A kid. You want to share a drink? What's up? Uh, <laughs> two straws, please. <laughs> sir, sir, um, vodka tonic, um, two straws, two please. Shot. and one shot. Let's put yeah, that table. yeah. So, and you know what? Have a shot to it, and and you know what? Actually, they, it, look, hey, wait, wait. Um, bartender, they, has anybody ordered a drink and they forgot about it? Do you have <laughs> do you have any drinks there that people forgot about? Jesus Christ! Can you guys you, you go to the bar do that? Do I, a bar dude, can I imagine? No, no. It's like, um, yeah, I know, um, and. I know it's a weird question to ask, but do you guys have any drinks people forgot about? Do you guys have any drinks people didn't finish? And you know what's pour it all in one glass? Wow. Pour, pour it all in one glass? Jungle juice. Yeah. Look I'm jungle looking for juice. that jungle juice. What's up? Yeah. <laughs> I'm looking. Yeah. Do you have anybody who um, has some type of disease and then didn't finish <laughs> his drink? I'm, yeah. You know, I haven't had a cold sore in a couple of days. Can you hook me up? I'm going to get one now. I'm Can you hook me up? Mm. Mm. You know that cold sore is real good, bro. Mm. Delicious, bro. <laughs> Say no but, mas, I mean, man. Say like no mas. It's one of the things. I mean, we talked about this, bro. Fucking dating. We, we, we talked about this. No, shit, I, know, okay. I, know, I know we talked about it, but it's, let's finish right. it with this. Let's yeah. finish it with this. For you to have a better opportunity with the opposite sex. Oh, wow. Okay. Or the same sex. I mean, I don't, I don't judge. Whatever the I fuck you want. I don't judge. <laughs> for you to have a better opportunity, Me? that's not your lane. No. That's not. not your lane. No, no, for sure. Your lane is somewhere else, man. Well, here's the thing. We're looking for a good time. That's yeah, all. That's why but we're that's there. not a good time for me. I don't know. For me, it's not a good time. I find that shit boring, dude. Dude, you tell me go. Dude, I'm go. super bored. Yeah, I'm, no, I'm no, bored out of my fucking no, mind. But I'm saying that's what I'm trying to say. So I'm you're bored not out my fucking so mind. That's not your spot either. That's what, that's what I'm trying to say. Like, I want to go to a sports bar where there's super loud vehicle music. I'm out of my fucking mind. Super loud music. I can't. The, can the drinks, yeah. drinks are t- look, dude. End of the day, dude. End of the day. I'm not gonna ask for drinks. Yeah, and but end of the day, dude. I'd rather go. To like a nice fucking like I said I've always mm-hmm. said this better go to a nice lounge where the music's not super fucking loud. Nice thing. Dude, even like this dude, look at this. My dude. other friends don't think the same way. Well, maybe you know? no, but here it take here's the thing: it just takes somebody to, to give a different thought. You know what I mean? Sure. You could have been like, "Hey, look, uh, guys, we know you, we do Wrigley all the fucking time, mm-hmm. right? We Wrigley, we know what Wrigley's at, right? Yeah. We know what this place is about. We know what we're gonna see. We know what we're gonna like here." Right, you know, it's a really cool fucking place out here. The speakeasy over here, dude, mm-hmm. that we can check out. Mm. It's really cool, man. Mm. Uh, music, you know, they always have somebody playing live. It's really down to earth. The drinks are fucking amazing. It's a little bit more expensive, but it's a better time. Yeah. Okay. Better time for us because we don't understand it. Yeah. Maybe, well, no, maybe but not better time for them. But maybe not. But maybe they don't know I'll better. Up guys, they are fucking. Yeah, but maybe they don't 25. know better. But but you could be that. You could be that guy. Look, it takes a leader to. You're right. It takes it a leader to to change things about, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? If you can be, I'm, I'm not saying there's wrong thing for them to go there. I'm not no, saying no, that no, either. No, for sure. But I'm trying to say it's not bad at the end to change change the D every mm-hmm. once in a while, right? Mm-hmm. It's like you know where you're going to meet there. You know where you're going to see there, right? But you guys can go to like a real nice speakeasy, a real nice lounge. You know, something more down to earth, right? Something more, you know, cool. You know, more um, relaxed. And um, meet some. Actually, a cooler woman, dude. Maybe you know, you know where you're gonna meet there, maybe. man. You're gonna meet some. Maybe, maybe, maybe they're in the same, the same lane, and maybe some, yeah. and, and not to this. You have if a better the same okay. way, like dude. We want to talk to some cool dudes. Yeah, exactly. It's like you're, you have a better chance of going out there and meeting um, some girls that are down there for the same reason. Like, I'm like, hey, I'm like, 
Maybe I'm not, maybe I'm not down to mess around yeah. tonight. But I'm down to have a conversation with you. Yeah. As you get to know you and yeah. see where this goes. Yeah. Right? This guy's smart, dude. This fucking guy's smart, dude. This guy's fucking genius. I'm sing I'm married. <laughs> <laughs> I love my girlfriend. <laughs> I almost say single. I almost yeah, say single, dude. Yeah. I'm almost, no, 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 I almost threw myself under the bus. Yeah. You're not no. single, bro. I'm happily married, bro. Married spirit, you're single. But not, no, not, no, no. <laughs> sing, I'm, spirit, I'm married to you, dude. You're married with your kids, spirit. I, dude, I'm already, I'm already paying for my kids' so I'm college fund right now, dude. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> no, but um, yeah, dude. I think, I think for you, man, you know, especially, okay, just think about this, um, the way you were dressed. You're not dressed for a sports bar. Yeah, but you're not dressed for a sports no, bar. No, no, no. I look good. That's that's it. Fucking that's priority. it. So just along with that, you're out of place. You were better off. You'd be better off going the way you are now. To a sports bar? Then, <laughs> yeah, you're right. You're 100% right. You're 100% right, dude. This guy's smart, dude. Look at this fucker, dude. Goddamn. This is my best friend. Ah, damn. Ah, damn. You're throwing that around like it means something, dude, right? You're throwing that around like it means something, right? There's no weight. Holds no right, weight. Holds no weight, dude. All right. We're, we're acquaintances at best. All right. We're, we're, you know what? We're work partners at best, dude. Right, dude you, you, that, you, you, you been throwing that best friend conversation a lot. A little, a, little, a little too often for me, dude. Man, I'm talking about everybody's best friend, dude. And, dude, so... Last podcast you weren't around, right? No, no, I had to work, man. I yeah, the work. You were busy. Yeah, no, sneaky so, snake. So I had sneaky snake. Um, pull a snooze lifesaver. Fest. Hey, what? I said, what? 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 I said what? lifesaver. Snooze fest. What? <laughs> lifesaver. You know what? He um, he did his part. Barely. <laughs> <laughs> Was he on? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um. So we had no. We had sneaky snake come on. Sneaky snake, dude. And he's always, um, he's, always, he's always down, dude. Always sneaky. He's always a little sneaky about yeah, it. Dude, always sneaky, dude. Yeah. I actually thought he was going to show up Saturday because Angel invited him. Angel I thought he was going to show up too. Maybe. Didn't show up. Yeah. He was busy at a fucking rodeo, though. Yeah. 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 Rodeo. Rodeo. rodeo people don't understand. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but um, yeah, so we had Sneaky Snake on. But I wanted to talk to you about a couple of things that happened okay. last week that we didn't. Obviously, Ernesto wasn't here. Ernesto yeah, was yeah, here, for so sure. Yeah, yeah. It, wasn't, it wasn't really for him. Let's, let's start off with. Um, the whole ninja thing. Ooh, ninja going over the mixer, and he was on Twitch, right? Three years, eight mil, bro. Oh, they signed them. Three years, eight mil. Three years for eight, eight million. million. It's not bad, dude. Not bad at all, dude. It's not bad. Not you don't have to worry about anything else. Yeah, you get that money automatically. You still get your fucking donations yeah. from people. No one subscribers, your, your Patreon, all that um, shit. I don't think he's getting paid on subs, which is completely fine. That's why they get him eight mil. But you sell your sponsors, dude. Ninja has a great brand, dude. Ninja has a fucking great brand, dude. He has a a sponsorship with Red Bull. He has a fucking great brand. People want to work with Ninja, dude. Regardless of what other people say, like, oh, he's kind of falling off. This, this, and that. Dude's an entertainer like anyone else. Dude's a motherfucking entertainer, dude. What he did for his career was. Pretty smart, man. Eight million, dude. Eight fucking million. A legit eight fucking million, dude. Dude, he's making more money than most fucking professionals in sports, man. Like, legitly. Like, like guaranteed. I know, I know a couple people who's making more money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like, dude, he, dude, dude's in a good spot, man. I mean, he, what he did was, hey, he's going to help a platform glow. Well, glow. Grow. Plus, I mean, he already has money in the bank. Dude, I mean, at this point, dude, if he wants to fucking, like, pursue something else, he can. Maybe some acting. Yeah. Depending on what, what he wants to do, you know? Yeah. What he did, hey, great. Hey, all the people look for that same deal now. Dr. Disrespect, I don't know if you ever heard of him. No. Oh, wait, is he the guy with a mustache? A mustache. Yeah. yeah, yeah all yeah, red, yeah. black. He's looking for the same deal, too. He's like, dude, I'll leave Twitch if I can get that same type of deal. So now other people look for that same deal. Because guaranteed fucking money. Who doesn't want that, Guaranteed dude? money, dude. You don't have to worry about fucking people subbing onto your... No, but here's, your, your well, here's, here's the difference, right? It's guaranteed yeah. millions of dollars. There's the, yeah, the diff- that's the difference, right? Because you... 
When you, anybody can subscribe, to, anybody can become a creator on Twitch. Uh, yeah, for sure. Anybody can become anybody can become a creator on Mixer too. Yeah, for sure, right? But once a company is like, "Hey, we we want you, we want to, you to help us grow. We want you specifically only over here, and not only that, we're going to give you a lot of fucking money." But what do you think they went to? What do you think they went to? Fucking Ninja, and no one else. He has a great brand. Yeah. He well, no, because there's people that there's brand. some there's people nothing that nothing negative yeah. behind them. Dude. Yeah, there's. But yeah, but that's the thing though, right? So now, now that he's opened this new lane, yeah. right? This new lane in the gaming industry, right? Yeah. Um, not only are you expecting money from your subscribers and your patrons and your yeah, yeah, your yeah. fan club, whatever the fuck it is, now you have companies that platforms, platforms, platforms. that that host videos, right? Mm-hmm. And they're like, hey, we want you specifically over here. Yeah. Now it's going to be open a new way, right? So now you have yeah, okay. Just so there's three main companies, right? There's Mixer, there's Twitch, and there's YouTube. Yeah. Those are the three main companies mm-hmm. for gaming, right? For sure. For um, live gaming. Yeah, correct. Right? Now, you have a lot of big names left. There's a lot of big names left. Huge names, dude. There's Ninja's, out of the sc- Ninja's permanently mixer now, right? Yeah. You got Tifu. You have Nikkei 30. Yeah. You have the Face Clan. Face you, Clan is, is, is a clan. It's a clan. Well, you, you, could but there, a clan. Yeah. you could sign the clan. You, you can, can, you can, can sign the clan. You yeah. can specifically sign the clan. Yeah. Yes, you can. There's there's a lot of fucking players. There's the guy you said, you know. There's a lot of there's a lot of big names still left in the game industry. Then now now that mixtures open this lane, yeah, I think we're gonna see a lot of this. We're gonna see companies permanently signing um, other um, other um, gamers it's specifically question. for them because they don't the, want them leaving. The the person that won the uh, Fortnite World Cup, Booga, yeah, who's gonna sign him? He's fucking sixteen. Yeah, does he have a brand behind him? Yeah. Not really. People, Not really. people he, like him because he's, yeah. he's, he's he a won, top right? Fortnite right. player. He won, he won, and he's he's technically the best world. Co- he's best player in the yeah, world. Yeah. Right? But is there is there anything behind him supporting him? No, but Not the, really. The, but here's here's the crazy thing about gaming, right? In the gaming world, you don't have to be the best player; they have the biggest following. No, 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 no. right? Mm-hmm. Ninja didn't even make the World Cup. No, 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 he didn't not make, at all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He didn't make the World Cup, right? But he's the number one guy. Yes. When he has winning, once again a brand yeah, behind yeah. him, winning nothing negative. All positive. Winning the World Cup doesn't mean really much. It means you want a lot of money, and you yeah. and now you're a name. Now you're a name, yeah, yeah, yeah. and people always people are gonna know who you are. Somewhat of a name. Yeah, people are gonna know who you are among, among the hardcore followers of the Fortnite community. Yeah, the Fortnite community, or even gaming community. Because most most game most gamers. Was, let's, let's put Fortnite community. Yeah, let's yeah. put most. Yeah. do most gaming. Okay, to say everyone says fuck. Let's say Fortnite community. Everybody knows who you are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, gaming community. Some people know. Uh, yeah, let's say at least half people know yeah, who yeah, you are, yeah, right? Yeah. So you have that, mm-hmm. right? And you and that's good. I mean, it's good. You won the first. You won the World Cup. Yeah. Awesome, right? Congrats. But end of the day, Nick, it's the um, um, Ninja is gonna make more money than you. Yeah, yeah. Tifu's gonna make more money than you. Ninja, I mean, um, Nick A Thirty is gonna make more money mm-hmm. for you. Mister, um, what's his name? Uh, disrespect. Mister Disrespect's gonna make more money because yeah, they yeah. already have that base. For sure, they already have the fan club. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They don't need the World Cup win. No, they don't. it would have looked good. It would look good on the record. Yeah, for sure. You yeah, know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, yeah. On the resume, mm-hmm. but they don't need that anymore. No, no. So now, so now, I mean, it's it's if um, Twitch is smart, you gotta get the next best thing. You sign, I think you sign Tifu real quick. Because if not, you can. If not, Mixer's gonna keep doing this. I mean, if I was yeah, Mixer, yeah, yeah, yeah. if I was Mixer, I was like, okay, you know, we're making a lot of money. You know, obviously Mixer's making a lot of money, but how about we spend some money, Tifu, right? Tifu, they sign, they sign up, yeah, they yeah. sign up, they sign up the big names. Maybe and maybe even in the contract, maybe in the contract, you know, the um, the ninja um, sign is like okay, you your video is going to be permanently only mixer, but you can only play with people who are on mixer too. They could they could right? put in the contract, and now it's just like they, they didn't because uh, for um um uh, ninja played with uh, myth, which is he's still on Twitch. Yeah, he's still on Twitch. Yeah. yeah. So you know, but they could do something along that too, right? Or they would like encourage you to only play with mixer mm-hmm. plays, right? So they say, okay, so let's say mixer like, okay, we get the biggest name. Mm-hmm. Let's go for the next guy. Tifu. Fortnite, Tifu. Let's get let's get Tifu only on mixer. Yeah. We're gonna offer you six million to come play with us. My 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 question is now is how come they're going after the girls, dude? The girls, they're because no no no. But here's the reason: because female players are looked down upon. Negative, negatively, because a lot of female girls wear 
They are they, they revealing. No, I say revealing okay, no, because like, the, the female play uh, some of the female all of them, but some yeah. of the female players, the ones that have the biggest followings. To be fair, right? Yeah, the ones that have the biggest followings or sexualized video gaming, right? Yes or no? Yes, yes or no? Yeah. Some girls, yes. Yeah. No, 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 girls, no. I'm saying the ones that have the biggest followings. Yeah, 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 yeah. The ones that have the biggest followings are the ones that are over sexualizing and um the gaming. Name oh, you're right you're you're, yeah. right, you're right you're right I can't um, name one yeah I can't name one that's over yeah. sexualized yeah I just know other girls that there's, there's don't a, do the yeah there's other games that have a huge following but they don't have the same as as the other the ones that you're right you're most that's, that's right. what I'm yeah. saying that's you're, what I'm saying you're 100 you're right so it's just, it's a trickier round to go okay. and I think for those girls it's it's very I mean it's, just, it's probably not gonna happen just because just because it's it's it is like a almost like a dark review. Of the gaming industry, yeah. right? It's almost like semi pornographic without having the like. It's not actually, it's, but it's not. It's, it's, it's not. It's not. It's not. It's not. not, not, it's not, not but it's, it might show a little cleavage. You know what I'm saying? But that's what I say. It goes down that lane, though. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It goes down that lane. Yeah, because yeah. they're selling, they're selling sex basically without actually having sex. Correct. You know what it's, I'm trying to say? It's as 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 whoever you are, you'll see it. Like all right, yeah, we yeah. know what you're selling. Yeah, you know, you get it. So. I, I don't think that's I don't think any of those companies would go down that lane because they just don't want that negative feedback that comes yeah. along with it, you know. And um, so, but you I mean you can have other other gamer other girls that mm-hmm. don't really go down that path and they kind of just do the whole like I'm, look we're just gamer I'm a girl who plays video games for sure that's it you mm-hmm. know maybe I'm pretty maybe I'm not it doesn't matter I, I just play games and I play really well mm-hmm. you know what I mean and maybe they go they could do that but I think the, I think they're kind of like just going to stick to the bigger names because I can't name a female gamer. Not that I watch uh, gaming. For sure. But I mean, I think of Valkyrie and um, she's with, uh, I believe, 100 Hertz. And then um, I've got her fucking name. She's a little, she's Asian. Um, really cute little girl. Yeah. Um, forgot her name. Yeah. But that's only two I can think of yeah. right now. And then like, and I, not that I really watch gamers all yeah, the time yeah. or at all really, but like I know Tifu. Never watched. It, never watched. I've never watched him play live. Yeah, or whatever. Right, Ninja. I've never watched him play live. Yeah, yeah. You know, I watched Naked Thirty. You know what I mean? Which Nikki Thirty? He, he YouTube should offer him a contract. I'm, I'm pretty sure it'll be pre- stupid not. To. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they're really close unless to. he already has a contract with them. And yeah, it's not yeah. said. Yeah, it's closed. It could be, and it could be. But if he's not, yeah. YouTube should pick him up. You know what I mean? That's his star. That's their star boy. Yeah, when it comes down to gaming. Yeah. So you like I know I know some of them right, but like I guess and I'm not really into the, and I'm not really yeah. in that world, but I know him. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, for sure. So when it comes to the female, I think it's just a harder sell. Plus, hard he's sell. also like you said, he's he signed with the agency right now. Yeah, CA, which is kind of cool because I mean he's had a couple uh, commercials. He with, had uh, a Box, had, uh, he had X commercial. Yeah, X commercial. Yeah, yeah. With Bice, right? That's fucking know. dope. Yeah, that's fucking dope, dude. Yeah, that's your agency going to work, man. Yeah, so. So I mean, it's it's crazy because it's almost like you know I always talk shit that you know esports not sports right I've, I've, for we've, sure we've yeah, had this conversation right fair enough but it just makes it more sport like because now we're signing contracts it's not contracts we're signing contracts and when you're getting the, you know you're getting paid so much every year you're making more money than most prof- prof- actual professional you know it's getting pro- most professional people they're putting bodies on the line dude yeah that's 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 it's kind of crazy. Uh, you know what? Fuck. Let's, let's not call them sports uh, sports guys. Actors. Fucking, they're acting. They're acting. They're no. They're, they're, pers- they're personas. Um, personas. You know what I'm saying? They're still. They're acting on camera. Yeah. yeah. You know what it's, I'm saying? I mean, they're they're selling the character, right? You know, because not like Ninja freaks out like that every fucking. Not like in real life, he's like whatever he does. You know what I mean? It's not like he's like. I don't know. It's not, yeah, it's, not, like it's, not, it's not like Ninja. Like it's like he ordered like a, a salad with without dressing yeah. on it and dressing aside, and he gets a salad with dressing on it. He's like, <laughs> I get a thing. You know what I mean? Come on. If he does that in hundred percent, that's yeah, 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 yeah. that's fucking hilarious. I want. I would be eating salad and he'd be like, <laughs> "You wouldn't be fucking mean, you fucking noob, you're a fucking noob waiter." <laughs> But um, yeah. I mean, I think it's crazy. I think I think it's, I mean the money that they're throwing around right now, in gaming, dude, it's game, fucking dude. bonkers, dude. This it's bonkers. I mean, you know what I mean so much potential. It's one of those things where it's like, if obviously we don't you know, ever played video games, right? For the most part, you know what I mean. 
but it was like one of those things like man if I would play if I would have not stopped playing video games you know what I mean like who because nobody thinks about that right? nobody like I mean now people have that mindset like let's start streaming yeah but when streaming wasn't making any money and the, op- and the, op- and the option was there and people were like I'm not gonna do that dude now, now internet bro yeah internet, and internet now people are like oh things. I wish I would have done it internet, internet I wish I would have done it dude I think if more people make more money off the internet than, than you think of dude with internet is it's it's his own economy, dude. Right? It's, it's his own field. Just selling goods, streaming, merchandise, um, live, streaming videos. Any way. streaming for gaming or streaming for fucking um, um, cam girls. Like, dude, like, it's it, what's yeah. it's it, it's, does, it's like yeah. I said, it's an economy. It's an it's, it's his own an, economy. It's his own uh, industry, really. Not tangible, um, but it's there. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, it's cool. It's cool. I just, I, I just. It was, it was weird because I, I I knew he was Twitch, but I didn't. I thought Twitch would be paid him or something. No, dude. But maybe they were. But maybe they just didn't have a contract with him. And now they. The, I mean, Twitch. I mean, once you get to a certain point, you're making sixty percent of your subs. Yeah. People that subscribe, you're making sixty yeah. percent of that money. But I bet he That's was. I bet he was making money. I bet they were giving him like some money on the side. Who knows? I, I think I don't, so. I, I would think know. so. I would think so. If it is, it's not enough because yeah. that's what we went yeah, to. Yeah, obviously, obviously. But I'm saying, I think there were, they just never had an, an pen and paper. You know what I'm saying? Unless unless Twitch got cocky, like, dude, everyone is on, everyone's with us. You think people are going to leave us? Well, they're they're going to. And Well, you lost all his subscribers for the most part. Probably. For sure. If that, not, that well, yes. But that, um, his page is actually being utilized by, uh, Twitch actually still owns his page. On Twitch, yeah, but people are, no, but here, they're, they're, here's, playing, here's they're playing other people's yeah, shit on there. Yeah, here's the thing though. You can own, you can own this, right? Yeah. But when it comes to um, people who watch people play video lives, yeah. nobody watch, nobody really goes back and watch. I wonder what they were playing in May of week two. No, for sure, no, nobody no, cares, no, no, no. dude. What's it, now? What's it's, now? It's what's now. Yeah, yeah like yeah. I want to watch what's at the moment. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I watch a highlight video. But I'm not gonna watch. I'm no, not gonna no, watch no, no, no. Yeah, yeah. you the stream you did four days ago. Yeah, yeah. It's not like a podcast. Yeah, yeah. Or a TV show, right? Mm-hmm. You know, like Joe Rogan can release. He he can release like four to six episodes a week, right? I'll go back. I'll go back and For watch sure. yeah, 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 yeah. an episode that I'm like, oh yeah, he had um 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 Brendan Schaub or Brian yeah, Callen, yeah, yeah. or he had um some scientists or some history, yeah, yeah. or he had Bernie Sanders, whatever it was, right? He had him on an episode. I missed it. I had to go back a couple of days and watch it. Mm-hmm. People are not doing that for fucking. No. Uh, people want to watch only what's live. If what's it's not that? live, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm over it. I'm done. I'm gonna wait till tomorrow until the new episode comes yeah. out. Yeah, I might see a clip or two yeah. on Facebook. But that's about it. So I mean, they might be able to carry a little bit right now, but eventually people will be like, "No, well, this is all ninjas old shit. Mm-hmm. I don't want to see this shit." Oh, he's on. Tw- he's on Mixer, and he's doing live right now. Yeah, he's doing. A, he's doing a video live right now. Yeah, let me let me bounce from here, and I'm, sure. gonna, I'm gonna go watch the live video instead of seeing the video from September 2016. <laughs> you know what I mean? Correct. So it's it's, it's, it's crazy. It's, it's crazy. Like I said, the gaming crazy. platform, uh, I mean, gaming industry is is changing, and and like I said, that was a big change. And who knows who who's the next person to get signed? Like I said, YouTube should sign fucking E40. Um, Nikki Thirty. I'm. I'm. Nick, I, I, yeah. Which they, I hope they under you know under. But no. Okay. So now, now here's a question though. Here's a question though. If YouTube breaks that seal, now it's getting a little weird, right? Yeah. Because YouTube doesn't do that with anybody. No, 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 no. YouTube has like partners. YouTube partners. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But then I don't think they have contracts like that. You know what I'm gonna say? Maybe I don't. Time. I don't think like they have like a contract like okay, we own you for three years. You gotta make content for us for three years. You know what I mean? It's one of those things where, like, we're a partner. As long as you want to make content, we're a partner. We'll help you. We'll promote your page. And we'll give you special abilities if, for you. If I was fucking Mixer, I'm going for e- um, Nikki 30. And no, if I was... That's no, a, no. Dude, streaming-wise, yeah. that's yeah. that's a big person. I'll go for Nikki yeah. 30. If, if I was Twitch, him, if I was Twitch, I would have offered Tifu a contract the now. day after. The day after. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you know what? The hour after. The hour after, I would have been like, hey, let me hook you up. Hey, uh... Do you want to aim a million? <laughs> you know, let's make you it want, ten. Do you want Two, ten? You know, I mean, let's let's do let's do short term. Let's do one year, three mil. What do you think? Yeah. Fucking gamers are winning right now, dude. Who knows, man? Who, gamers who, who are winning. Dude. Knows? You know who? You know who wish you can get a contract? Jeremy Lin, dude. <laughs> Fuck, dude. 
Fuck, <laughs> dude. Dude, you tell me, Tief. I mean, not Tifu. Dude, well, well, you tell I me, mean, you tell me, a non-athlete got a contract before it's Jeremy Lin. <laughs> dude, Jeremy Lin has no offers on the table right now, dude. Dude, dude. Socks. So, so I saw this. I saw this. Did the, the like I said? Yeah. This is last week, but I didn't. Have but still, a, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Sneaky snake and came me, bro. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, my bra. Um. Hey, me, bra. Bra, bra, bra. He so dude, I saw this. I saw this as like when it, it hurt you. It hurt you. Right? It hurt me, dude. And because you know, Daily Sound, we're big, we're big Jeremy Lin fans. Yeah, we you know are. Yes, we are. I know yeah. Drake won him a title. Yeah, I get that. You know what I mean? I know yeah, yeah. Drake did much more than um, Jeremy Lin did, um, but didn't get him a contract. But yeah, Drake didn't help him out to get him a contract. Yeah, I mean, Drake never threw a, a basketball in his life, but <laughs> he did more than Jeremy Lin. Yeah, yeah, he did. Yeah, I mean, and then I'm talking, and I'm talking to those people who believe that because. Dude, it was a little. It was a little. It was depressing, man. I didn't like, especially when we like him. Dude. Yeah, we like I him. like German Lin, dude. Yeah, I sure. like German Lin. And I think he's a hell There's of a player. There's nothing negative behind German. Yeah, Lin, I think he's a good player. I think he's. Yeah. I think he's a really good player. But be, people look past him because he's Asian. Because he's Asian, unfortunately. I, th- dude. I think he does play a pack. I think he does play a fucking. It does, dude. It does. And, and when we I, thought when we thought of German Lin in the beginning, bro, back yeah. in. 2004 or 5? I got not relax, dude. We're, we're talking like, about like 20, maybe 2012, dude. Back when he had his moment? Oh, dude, well, Linsanity? What was Linsanity? Linsanity dude? happened probably, okay, we're in 2019 right now, right? Yeah. It probably happened around 2014. Five years ago. But, when we heard of Linsanity, like, bro, we couldn't believe it. Yeah. Like, bro, you're Asian, dude. You're, yeah. It's you're crazy. doing math in the fucking court. Crazy. Yeah. You're not playing ball, bro. Yeah. It was one of those things. It's like seeing a Mexican play basketball. Yeah, yeah. And it happened. Yeah, exactly. And it happened, you know what I'm saying? And so a video comes out with him. Yeah. He's in the uh, in Chinese um, or Asian or ta- Taiwanese. I don't mm-hmm. know what it was, but he was basically um, like a, some like conference or yeah, or some I don't know something right. Mm-hmm. Some speaking um, event. Yeah, and he's giving the he's basically telling people like, hey man, fucking. They probably asked him questions like, where what team are you gonna play for next season? And he probably broke. He probably broke. He had moments where he had been he had this had been building up for some time. And he was just like. Look, man, these teams don't want me. They have forgotten about me. I feel like they, 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 they have they, they don't want anything to do with me. Um, and it sucks. And I feel like my NBA dream is over. Like my dream, my career in M- um, basketball is over. You know, NBA, NBA, NBA is over. Well, NBA, but, over but uh, that's Chinese what, and yeah, money. but that's all. That's what that's what matters. Mm-hmm. Not money wise. He he made money. He made some money in NBA. You know, he has some really good contracts after the New York Knicks. Mm-hmm. He's he's set. He's set. But as a as an athlete, you always want to play in, in the, the top league, top, right? Yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. So he said that, and he had this moment, and then um, he had this. Um, I'm not sure if it was Taiwanese or Chinese um, guy translating for him. I just hope the guy was translating like he was talking. You know what I'm saying? Because mm. like German Ling was like crying half halfway through, and I hope the Chinese guy was like. <laughs> okay, uh, <laughs> I hope he was like cause, spread it out, man. Like you can't yeah. say this normally, but like. I wish I feel like they forgot about me. When you see a man crying and the and the translator is like, "Hey, he feels like they forgot about him." I don't know. I don't want to tell you guys. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? But um, it was it was it was sad dude because like I said, we like him. And I saw a video recently um when he talked about a guy broke it down. He broke down his stats per season mm-hmm. and explained where his season is like he had where he had a good season, where he had a bad season, and the factors said. Mm-hmm. Contributed to that, right? And basically, the, the, from what I understand from the video and what the guy's final thought was, was like he's a good player. Like in the NBA, he should be on a team. Yeah, he should be on a team. The numbers that he gives out, mm-hmm. and if you if you put him on the right team, if you put him basically, the guy said like if you put him on a pick and roll team, whereas as you know, people are moving around and yeah, they're yeah. giving like a Golden State team. Yeah, right. If you give him, you give him this opportunity to shoot, he's gonna get you points. You know, you give Jeremy Lin openings, he's gonna score for you, mm-hmm. right? So there's teams out there for him, right? There's teams out there that he can he can contribute. He can give good numbers. He can give a good assist ratio. He can give um, a assist percentage and a good um, shooting percentage, right? Mm-hmm. He's gonna get you points. So why? So what's so he basically his his ending the ending of that video was like. So why isn't he on the team? Well, he's more than capable. Because just dude, just players on yeah, just players on multiple teams. They play one. They play okay. 
I, da, um, Danny Green. You know who Danny yeah, Green yeah, yeah. is? Yeah, yeah. He's on the uh, Raptors. He was on the Raptors. Now was. On yeah, the, and now he's on Lakers. the um, Lakers, right? Mm-hmm. He doesn't do it. I mean, at least I don't see Number-wise, I don't see it. Mm-hmm. Maybe behind the scenes, he does a lot more. You know, yeah, yeah. he plays good defense or, you know, when he's on the floor, the mm-hmm. team plays better, right? Mm-hmm. There's a lot of things, right? But the numbers he puts up are not good. Only great. Nothing crazy. Nothing crazy. You know what I mean? You know, he might put a couple of points up, and maybe he might have one game where he does 21 points, yeah. and he has, like, four other games where he has, like, two, four, six points. Yeah. You know what I mean? And you have a guy like Jeremy Lin, who if you give him time, he consistently gets you points and gets you assists, but you can't find a team. You know? There's a lot of And then there's players, like, are too old, and they're still playing. You mean uh, Vince Carter? Yeah, like, okay, like Vince Carter. <laughs> hell of a player. And his heyday, a hell of a player. Yeah. And mentoring? Yeah, I mean, I guess he can mentor a lot of players, right? <laughs> He's on the... Uh... Who is it with? Uh, Hawks. Year? He is with Hawks, Hawks yeah. yeah. But he's not putting At out... 42 years old? Yeah. He's not putting out numbers. No. You tell me Germany can't find a minimum contract? A, minimum, a, better, a veteran's better contract? Yeah. yeah. Which is, I think it's 20 or 50,000? No, it's more than that. More than that? Yeah, it's more than that. Oh, okay. But, you know, you, you can't find a contract with that? You tell me you can't offer him $1 million? And, you know? uh, unfortunately, bro, it's because it's he's Asian, man. I, just, I, I don't want to see it that way, but it, it is. I, I there's no other. There's no other reason. People don't give him the. I, I, I just don't see why people don't give him the respect that he deserves. Put on the Bulls. We need people. No, actually, Bulls is pretty sad. Mm, we, we could use German land. I'm not against with it, but yeah, yeah. Uh, point guard wise, we're sure, sad. Sure, we're sure, sad. Sure, we're sure, sad. Yeah. We don't. I mean, if they hadn't signed a couple of players, I would be 100 percent down yeah, for yeah, it. Yeah. We're sad. Um, but there's other teams that he could be on, man. Yeah. How about other teams? Yeah, yeah, for sure. There's thirty. Was thirty one? Thirty teams in the league. Thirty. Thirty teams in the yeah, league. Yeah, thirty. Yeah. Thirty teams in the league, and now one of those teams need a backup, even or even a backup to the backup point guard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who's you know consistently get, who can get you points out there? If Which you need, Lynn Sanity can come back. No, not even Lynn Sanity. Just Lynn in general. Dude. Yeah. He can get you points. If you give him his opportunity, mm-hmm. and if you get him on the right team, he's gonna get you at least ten points. Yeah. There's no place that don't give you shit, dude. You know what I mean? And they're there on the bench, riding the bench all all season long. Chilling, and you're like, and you're like, this dude's making two million to sit on the bench. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then like sometimes you and sometimes when I feel like an NBA, like I see players that are still on there, like on the team. Yeah. And I'm like, why are they getting paid? What are they doing? My size, they might have some speed, they might have you some. You know what I mean? Hype. It's like I haven't yeah. seen it. Uh, dude, I think his I think his jersey is collecting dust right now, dude. <laughs> Could have swore I saw some spider webs on it, dude. You know what I mean? It's a, the last name on his fucking jersey is starting to fall off. You know what I mean? It's starting to like, it's starting to like crease down. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, dude. <laughs> yeah, man. Unfortunately, that's how it is, bro. Yeah, it, it sucks, man. It sucks. I it mean, does suck, man. It does suck because you know he's a, you know he's good enough. He's some, in my eyes. Yeah, for sure. You know he was he had a couple of injuries, but you know fucking the right hands with injuries. Everybody has their injuries, right? People get hurt. And not to see him on a on a NBA team for him to have that moment, and it's funny because when he won the, I mean, you know, obviously he won the championship, so that's amazing, yeah, yeah. right? But when he won the championship, like uh, a week later, I saw him on a podcast. Yeah. Um, you remember Niga Higa? No. He was um this Asian guy who did YouTube videos, who like how to be a ninja, how to be a gangster. It was really popular back in the day. Okay. And he used to do videos like that. How to be a ninja, how to be a nerd, how to be a gangster. Yeah, yeah. And he's he's carrying on his fame. He has like a YouTube following, right? Yeah, yeah. He's, he, he used to be a number one. He used to be number one subscribed YouTuber. Really? Yeah. You don't I remember this guy? No, I don't. He used to be a number one subscribed YouTuber yeah, back in, back when YouTube was in like early stages, yeah, right? Yeah. With Smosh and all these other big um, YouTube channels that mm-hmm. were back then, right? And... He had him on his podcast. He has a podcast, and he had him on his podcast, mm-hmm. and and he was talking about his, uh, you know, his like how he felt about not playing as much as he wanted to. Mm-hmm. You know, he only had a couple minutes in the playoff series versus um, going to state. Yeah, you know, and he was like, well, and he was just telling me he was describing how, um, you know, it's like what well, people don't know. When people be asking like, like, you know, why aren't you putting up points? Why aren't you doing like getting more assists? Yeah, but he's like, sometimes it's like I can't, you know, because the coach would tell me right before I go on the on the floor, he'd be like. Um, I don't want you really to shoot. I just want you to kind of get the momentum going again. So just look for open passes. You know, try to get try to get um uh Leonard to, um score. Mm-hmm. Try to get Lowry to score. Try to get um Van Fleet to score. Try to get these players to score. Yeah, I don't want you taking shots. Just go out there and try to get try to get them going. Yeah, so they can starting to get you know some heat behind them again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? And he's like, you don't know that, right? 
I'm like, so, you know, I see Jerm, uh, you know, I see Jeremy Lehner or whoever on the floor. And I'm like, why aren't you getting points? Why didn't, why didn't you take the shot? You should have taken the shot, bro. Like, it's right there. Mm-hmm. But the coach specifically told him not to take shots. For sure. Yeah. You know what I mean? Just, and for a player, that hurts. Right? Because like, now, you know, maybe you're not going to be on the team next year. So now you're like, oh, well, you only contributed six points average, averagely in the, in the season. I mean, you're kind of going downhill, bro. Or is it, or your coach, the coach was like, hey, I don't want you to shoot. I don't want you to, I want you to pass the ball. I want you to create, create openings for the players. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? And that shit that we don't think, because I didn't think anything about that. No, for sure. That's, I didn't think about that. Sh- yeah, I always, sh- you know, my thing was like, why aren't they making points? But sometimes, yeah, 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 yeah. you're right. The coach is going to decide what you're going to do, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, maybe if you have a, a clear opening, you take shot no matter yeah, what, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. It's like, I have to, you know. But um, but he was talking. He was saying that he's like, I don't want to throw anybody on the bus. But basically, that's how it is. You know what I mean? Coaches tell me one thing, and I do what they tell me to do. Yeah. And if not, then I, yeah. And if, and if I don't do that, they're not gonna put me in the game. Yeah, like yeah, yeah. they're not gonna tell you to. Okay, I know. Okay, Jeremy Lin, I know you got six points in two minutes. I didn't want that from you. I wanted I wanted four of those points to belong belong to um Leonard. Yeah. And I wanted two of those points to belong to Laurie. Yeah. What are you doing, bro? Get on the bench. And that's all. And, and, that's right it. and now you need, now you don't play for the rest because now he knows you're not going to listen to him. Yeah. So it was one of those things where he was talking about that. He was being very truthful. And he was like, and he even talked about, he's like, yes, he was like, next season, I don't know where, where I'll end up going, but we you know just a couple of offers. And then, you know, some weeks later, right, or a couple of months later, now I'm just like, oh. Uh, my, well, my question is now, dude, what the fuck is his agent doing? What's his fucking agent doing? His agent should be fucking working overtime right now. Getting this motherfucker a job. Yeah. Dude. No, obviously. I mean, overtime, look, look, dude. I, I, I look, a good brand. I, I look, People you know, like him? Yeah. As an, as an agent, trust me, that dude's trying his hardest to get him. I hope he is. Because if not, if not, because you got to remember this. There's shittier players getting great fucking yeah. deals, man. Remember this. As an agent, your client yeah. makes you money. Yeah. So you want to get your client as much money as possible. For sure. Because you know you're, that's you know that's where you get your money from. For sure, yeah. yeah. So you, you, in that case, I would I would almost say I'm 100 percent certain that that dude is working day, and, especially yeah. if it's one of his few clients. That dude's working day and night, mm-hmm. day and night. Yeah, to be yeah. like to get as much money to get him some money, something because yeah, he needs yeah. he needs his fucking money too. And um, but I mean, at least to this point, we don't know. There's nothing, right? But you have other players too, like um, Camilo Anthony, right? Where he, I mean, got Camilo, up on the you know, a couple years ago. Yeah, but no, I mean, Camilo has like, Camilo has a, you know, he has a history of like of being a player that appeals, you know, if he's going to be on your team, it's not going to. Yeah, yeah, he's you not going to produce much. Well, he's going to produce, but he's not going to get you a championship, right? Yeah. He has that history, right? Yeah, yeah. But, I mean, he still have a fucking player. And, you know, he was on, um, what I don't know, I forgot what the East Band show is called. Was with the one with Steven, um, you know what I'm talking about? Mm-hmm. The brother? The one I said I don't like? Steven. Um, no, I don't remember. I forgot what his name is. But it's not an ESPN, um, ESPN show, ESPN, right? ESPN, okay. Uh, first Take? ESPN, I first, think I, first I, Take. Yeah, it's, yeah, yeah, I think it's called First Take. take. Yeah. And, he, and he was on that show with um, Steven something. I forgot what his name Steven, is. Steven um, A. Smith? Yeah, Steven A. Smith. Yeah, yeah Steven A. Smith. A. Smith and uh, then... What's the other dude? Yeah, but he was just—he yeah. was just with Stephen A. Smith, okay, okay. and he was doing an interview one on one with him, and he was like, "You tell you he's like, you're trying to tell me that in a 15 man squad on 30 teams, I can't get one of those spots." And I'm, and I was like, "Yeah, yeah. I mean, fucking Camelo can't get one of those spots. You tell me Camelo's not the best player among one of those fucking players? He's toxic. He's cancer." He's, but he's still a player. He's still a hell of a player. He's, he's toxic, though. He's, he's cancer to the team, dude. He's still, if he doesn't get his way, it, it starts going downhill. No, but that's the thing. And then if he says, like, I've never been down. I've never been against coming off the bench. Yeah. He's like, I've never been against. But he's just like, you got to talk to me, man. You can't assume shit from me either. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? You got to talk to me. Maybe I'll fight it up a little bit. But if you explain it, he's like, well, I mean, this is him saying it, right? So who knows yeah. how true it is. But he's like, you explain it to me. You know, I would be willing to help the team. Because then they, sure. he's like, and they, I just want to win a championship. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? And, you know, and obviously there's only a couple of teams that he could play on that would win him a championship right now. Yeah. Which would be like, unless he signed up with, 
um, the Lakers, Lakers or maybe Golden, Golden State. State. Raptors, I don't see it happening. We, fuck, fuck. Pistons. Pist- no, Pist- not, not Pistons. Pistons. Uh, Clippers. Um, Houston. Or even he calls back to the Houston Rockets. Yeah. You know what I mean? Or um, the Heat with Jimmy Butler. Just yeah. a couple teams, right? But, um, yeah, he was just saying that. And, you know, I was like, yeah, I mean, there's spots. There should be spots for Jeremy Lin and um, Carmelo Anthony. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. It makes it makes no sense. Shit, people pick up Dwayne Wade right now, dude. If he came back, people oh go. The, oh yeah, if Wade was to come back, he yeah. would have a spot. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? He would have a spot. And not saying he's not a bad player. He's not a good player, but I'm saying obviously he would have a spot. There's a lot of players that would have yeah. a spot. And there's a lot of players that are in the league right now currently that are playing and and teams that you know don't produce numbers. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like I said, I don't know what they do behind behind the scenes. I don't know if they're like the best practice partners to have around, you know what I'm trying to say? I, I, but, and, and when it comes to the game, they're not putting much numbers Yeah, up. they're not doing shit, dude. They're just chilling. You know? Yeah, yeah. Not totally so, good. you know, I was surprising. I just followed Jeremy Lin. Yeah, in that of moment. course. We... And, you know, I personally would like to see him on a team. I mean, like I said, if, if, if the Bulls had the opportunity and say somehow I became the boss of the Bulls, <laughs> hit me up, hit me up. Um, I would, yeah, I would definitely put him on the team. I would definitely put him on. I mean, like, I, I mean, but I'm a fan. I don't know. Yeah, 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 for sure, for sure. I don't know. I mean, well, if you're German Lynn, dude, and let and let's say, dude, let's say NBA, your NBA career is done. You have, have a career. career. You have, have, have a career. You have a career. Have a career. You got a championship. Not that we want it, but you yeah. got a championship. You you had your, you were, your time. You were, you've been the number. You've been one of the. I was say I was I was gonna say number one Asian player in the league, but we know who that belongs to. Yeah, Yang Ming. Yang Ming. But you were number two at least. Yeah, for sure. You were the number two Asian player. You had a good couple seasons. You came from nowhere and became a starter. Yeah. You got a graduated mil- from Harvard. Yeah. You got a million dollar contract. Graduated from motherfucking Harvard too. People, people are always going to know who Jeremy Lin was. Yeah, Lin you know, Sammy, your name is there. Your name is yeah, there. Yeah. You know what I mean? Um, you got a championship with some players like Carmelo Anthony will never have. Yeah. Right or never or haven't gotten at least. And, and sniff the championship, yeah. dude. And I mean, you know. I bet you could play if you wanted to continue playing basketball. China, dude. There's China. You can make some China money. China play a fucking shitload yeah. for you, dude. You can um, play in the big three. You know what I mean? Ice Cube's league. Yeah. You know what I mean? But if not, I mean, personally, I think you should be on the team. You should be on an NBA team. Yeah. You should play um, in one of those 30 teams. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? I said if we if we didn't if we had less point guards, I would love you in Chicago Bulls because yeah. I, I like you. And, um, but yeah, you should be. You should be somewhere, for sure. You should be somewhere, for sure. It doesn't make sense, but I mean, like I said, I don't know. I don't know. I really love basketball. I'm just a fan. Talking made this no story. <laughs> but yeah, dude, no, you're right, man. I mean, hopefully something goes. Hopefully he, you know, he has something, and if it doesn't, then hey, man, good run. It was a good, it was a good run. Good it run. Was a good run. Good run, man. Um, we're, dude, we're almost at the hour mark, man. Yeah, anything, hour mark. anything else you want to say to the people, dude? Any question you want to ask? Nah, bro. I'm fucking. I'm. I'm straight, man. I mean, good. And then uh, the Kobe Lawler fight, but we kind of talked about we that. that. Shit, yeah, we fucked it. <laughs> he broke it down he before the podcast started. Yeah. <laughs> you don't want to brought brought up, dude. You I did, did. Yeah, I did. yeah. Like I said, we never talked about MMA anymore. So I'm like, all right, let me talk to him outside of the podcast. Yeah. You know, it was a great, it was a great conversation we had. It was good. It was, well, it, was, it was for the podcast. It was for the yeah, podcast. Yeah, it was. Should have saved podcast. it next time. But guys, but, yeah. um. Well, it's that time of day, man. Yes, sir. The yes, end sir. is near. So then I take the final number. No, my dude. friends. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, I don't remember the lyrics right now. <laughs> you no, know what? Let me sing it to you guys, man. Sing it to me, bro. Sing it to Let me. Let me sing it to you dude. guys. Sing it to dude. me. Sing it to me, dude. We don't have sponsors. We're not making no, we money off this no, shit. So we, we can play with not have sponsors. Fuck we want, dude. Uh, not yet, at least. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Let me get this. Um, Tell me, bro. Tell me. Tell me, dude, it's like okay, he's like, uh, let me. Can you talk to people while tell I fucking me, look the shit up, dude. Tell me, hey man, hey, I just appreciate you guys fucking joining us in this uh, journey, dude. This journey of just good vibes and drinks and uh, great conversation. And, and yeah, dude. Okay, dude. Okay, hey, don't oh. don't suffer. <clears throat> My now, the end is near. And so I face the final curtain. My friend, I'll say it clear. 
Ooh. I'll state my case of which I'm certain. I've lived a life that's full. I've tried every, to travel each and every <laughs> highway. Dude, I, I close my eyes a little too much. Hey, dude, but hey, more. Beautiful. beautiful. But more than this, I did it my way. Hey, beautiful, dude. Beautiful. All right, guys. That's beautiful. all. That's it. Um, please don't take this episode down. Um, we do not own those pap- We do not yeah. own the property of that um, lyrics. <laughs> We That's make we make no money. No money. We, we're actually in debt. So, um, <laughs> not kidding. But um, yeah, dude, we did it our way, man. For sure, our way. We did All it our time. way, um, guys. So yeah, guys, keep episode keep an eye out, baby. What? I said episode ninety six. Oh, episode ninety six. Keep keep um keep an eye out for those um tutorials on mm-hmm. the drinks that we're making. Um, should be up in a couple weeks. Um, like always, guys, you can find us on every podcast station, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, um, Twitter. We're all over the fucking place. Um, come on, any last words hey, to the people? Dude, I'm streaming again. Find me on Twitch, King D is Live. Uh, on Instagram, King D is Live. So, yeah, King D yeah. is or King D is Live. Yeah. And then we post um, daily memes on our <laughs> on our Instagram page. So, if you guys want to laugh for a little bit and you guys yeah. want to see the ugliest snarl, in fucking history, dude. <laughs> I mean, there's shit that gives you nightmares. You know Go I mean? to our highlights and daily memes and all, dude. It's, it's, it's a good there, time. Dude. Literally, dude. Literally, I. Good time. <laughs> so, I sometimes I wake up in a cold sweat at night. Uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm telling you, it's the best one I've seen so far, dude. Best, the best dude. one. Out of all the memes, yeah. that's the best one. And then um, we have Easter eggs and our memes, too. Every once in a while, you can catch a sneaky snake hiding in the, hiding <laughs> the tall grass. You know what I'm saying? You know, it's like a Pokemon goes. Yeah. Um, so you guys, <coughs> thank you for listening. This is Daily Sanya signing off. Peace.